Hi guys, you are getting this video because we um, need you to either take the math or the reading test from the map fall sessions that we've done. You might have just had a scheduling conflict and when you were attending in person or you've been attending online and you weren't able to attend our in-person ones. So for the first time, we are going ahead with an online testing option for both MAP tests. So we put together um, this screen presentation for you and I'm gonna keep it as simple as possible. And today we're just gonna focus on step one. We need to check to make sure your Chromebook is ready for MAP testing. So if I slide myself over here, um, I just want you to click into the book and then all you have to do is follow these steps. Step one is the device readiness check. I click again. And we're going to watch a video so we can make sure your Chromebook is ready. Please make sure your Chromebook is fully charged and the charger is available or the charger is available if you do need it. The video is linked in this blue underline right here. So I'm going to actually take you through it right now. Yours may end up looking a little bit different than mine, but it's kind of the same path. This is a video that will help you make sure your Chromebook is ready. And that's our step one. Step two, we will actually be administering the tests. So if at any time you have difficulty doing this readiness check, all you need to do is email me and I will help you troubleshoot trying to figure out how we can make your Chromebook be test ready. So go ahead and click the device readiness check. And it's a very user friendly screen when it eventually loads. Okay, we just got to give it a moment. And we're almost in business. The key thing to remember with map testing is um, it we use this in a variety of ways. Number one, to measure your learning and number two for course placement and curriculum instruction. So as always, we want you to test your best. It is an untimed test and we allow for you to take as much time as you need. And then we will then um, evaluate your growth from the last time you've taken it. So our fall testing window, as you can imagine, is through November. So we wanna get this taken care of as soon as we can. And with potentially all of us going online, we want to make sure that we are ready so that way if we need to troubleshoot we can and then we can get the tests all taken within the next week. All right on the readiness check all I have to do is click begin and this video will take you through each step. Got it. How to use. You will perform steps in new tabs. After each step come back to this original tab for the next instruction. If you ever miss a step you can use the next or the back here. Okay, I'm gonna hit okay. Now I will select what device, and this is where we're gonna differ a little bit. I am gonna um, choose Chromebook because that's what you guys are choosing, but I also have the capabilities within here. Our preference is that you test on your Chromebook and that will help us have a uniform delivery and uniform troubleshooting. So I too am gonna select Chromebook. And it tells me I'm going to open this site. I'm going to wait for a message to appear that tells me whether my Chromebook passes or fails. And then I'll return to the tab. So ready. And now I get to open the website. Really nicely laid out for us. It takes me to the website in just a second. And it's doing the series of diagnostic checks that it needs for testing. And you just simply wait patiently on this step. And my test, uh, my machine has passed the check. So I am good to go. So I do not need to test again. There are instructions. If your machine would fail, there are different things that you can do. And you can also contact me and we will take it from there. So right now I need to go back to my video list and I'm just gonna take a quick look here at, and I probably need to move this so we can all see here, yep. And so I'm gonna click back to the device readiness tab and I'm gonna tell it that my computer passed. All right, I gotta get rid of this toolbar somehow. All right, now I'm ready to go to the testing site. So I hit continue. And now I am gonna check, um, open the math growth testing site. So this is the site that you are used to that typically we use an internal secure lockdown browser. 
So the screen should look familiar. I hit got it. If log in appears, tell your teacher you're ready and you can click X to close. If log in does not appear, you will hit the continue button. All right, so I am gonna hit next. All right, and I go back, okay. If log in appears, okay, so where is that testing site? Okay, I'm gonna go back just to GIF to make sure I can open the site. Open the map testing site, look for login. Got it. Okay, login means your device is ready. All right, if login does not appear. Okay guys, I'm struggling here. I need to find out where the site is because I want to hit, let's hit next. You might see another message. Oops, where's my testing window? Oh, here we go. Now I'm gonna open the test site. Just took a couple more screens of instruction. This is my first time going all the way through with this too. All right, so NWA is opening up and I'll get my results. And I do see the login instruction. So my computer is fully ready for testing. So if you would please go through these same exact steps that I just took you through, and when you get to this screen, all you need to do is you can hit the X and log out. And um, unless you don't get that login screen, and then you can email me and I will help you troubleshoot whether we have to Zoom together to go through it or whatever we can to solve it so you can be ready to test. So in a nutshell, please do step one, check your machine for readiness, and then let me know if it is a problem at all that your machine appears to not be capable of testing right now and we'll have to make some adjustments within it. And then just stay tuned and I will be releasing the testing schedule. Some of you that just have to finish the test, hopefully your test will pick up where we left off. That's kind of experimental right now, but either way, we're gonna get a test score from you. So um, please finish this step. And then we will take it from there. Thanks again for doing what you need to do and hope to be in contact with you soon.